Hi, my name is Dana Beck. Welcome to my YouTube video. And today, what I'd like to share with you are important tools that every entrepreneur should be using. Tools that every entrepreneur should be using to build their business online. Well, let's get right into it. So what are some of these tools that will help you as an entrepreneur working online to increase your business, to, to really help you grow your business? Um, you know, what tools do you use to build and maintain your online business? Um, and there's, there's a list of core tools every online entrepreneur should have in their collection of tools. And I'm going to go through a list right now of all the tools that I frequently use uh, as an entrepreneur. So the first one, and this is one that, you know, many of you I'm sure are familiar with, but let me go with the first one. First one is ClickFunnels. Well, what is ClickFunnels? Well, ClickFunnels is a robust and a very powerful tool for anyone who promote, you know, who promotes their service or their product online. And it is an online sales funnel builder that helps businesses market, sell, and deliver their products online. And ClickFunnels, you know, admit, they make it super easy uh, to create marketing uh, and sales funnels from the ground up um, as it incorporates into all the core elements that you need to have, uh, a, you know, you need to have an order, you know, to have a functional and effective sales funnel. Well, what does all that, you know, blah, blah, blah mean? Basically, what it means is that click panels is a very simple method that walks you step by step how to build outstanding funnels that catch you know your prospects attention that will convert and they have all kinds of tutorials and all kinds of tools i mean it, it's it's quite a, a very, again it's a very robust product so this is not a um, click funnels promo so this is just one tool that i use what's another tool well another tool that i use is a tool called click magic now, Click Magic um, is an online marketing platform that allows you to take track and optimize um, all of your marketing efforts. And uh, you know, and many you know marketers waste tons of money on advertise or, you know, or advertising efforts that aren't working. With Click Magic, you can identify quickly what marketing strategy st strategies are working and what strategies are not. Now, yes, I am reading you know, th these definitions are pretty much what they have on their individual websites, but I use Click Magic, and it will help you to track, you know, how many clicks you've had, how many abandons you had, how many, um, how many subscribers you've had, how many people open up your emails, and that's only a part of it. And it has a wide variety of tools that will help you to track how successful your campaigns are, your emails, you know, your emails that you send out. You can also track those as well. Um, even your um, social media posts, you can track those with Click Magic as well. And it will it will also help you to mask your, um, you know, if you've got like an affiliate URL, it will also show you how you can effectively mask that. So no one can steal your, you know, your affiliate ID. <laughs> but anyway, but Click Magic is a very, very, it's a great product, very powerful product. Well, what's another tool that I use? Well, you know, you, you've heard about autoresponders. Well, I use this autoresponder, but there are many, many more out there. Um, I use GetResponse, but there's AWeber, there's um, uh, Constant Contact, there's Mailchimp. I'm not going to review all of those, but this is just a sampling of the tools that I use. So GetResponse, and GetResponse is an email marketing platform, and it enables you to create a valuable marketing list of prospects, partners, and clients so you can develop relationships with them and build, you know, a responsive, a responsive and profitable customized uh, base, customized list. And there are numerous tools that GetResponse offers, you know, things like A-B testing uh, and, you know, free landing pages, free uh, web forms. Um, newsletter templates and so forth and so forth and get response is a, is a great autoresponder and um, you know like I said I've been using it for a number of years and 
um, it, it's really, really, you know, uh, met the needs that I have. Um, and uh, it, again, it's affordable and it has tons and tons of tools and tutorials and it's a very, very good product. So that, that's your autoresponder. And again, there are other autoresponders, but this is the one that I use. Um, and then what else? Okay, so you've got your domain, you know, mydomain.com. When you've got to register it somewhere, well, I use uh, a product called Namecheap. Maybe you're you familiar with them. I don't know. But um, Namecheap, you know, is, an, and I'm, I'm reading their, uh, their definition. Namecheap is an uh, ICANN, I-C-A-N-N, accredited registrar, which provides services on domain name registration and offers for sale domain names that are registered to third parties, also known as aftermarket domain names. And it is also a web hosting company based in Phoenix, Arizona. The company claims to manage over 10 million domains. That's a lot of domains. And it is the second or third largest domain registration company. And the reason why I use Namecheap, it's easy to use and I do not now, this is my preference. You don't have to do this, obviously, but this is my preference. Uh, with my uh, web hosting company, whether you use HostGator or GoDaddy or Bluehost or whatever, um, whatever hosting company you use, I keep my domain registration separate from my hosting company because if you've got your domain name registered with your hosting company and you decide to change hosting companies, that can be a real nightmare because not only do you have to transfer your website to your new hosting company, you also have to transfer the name registration to the new hosting company. This way, by putting all my domain names with Namecheap, all I have to do is just move the pointer um, for, the, uh, for the website uh, to, my new, uh, to my new domain. Uh, to, excuse me, to buy a new uh, hosting company. But my domain name stays with Namecheap, so I don't have to move that around. I don't have to even, you know, worry about that. So anyway, that's why I use Namecheap. It's real easy to use. It's very, very inexpensive. And again, it's, it's just a great, it's a great place to register your domains. All right, anyway, moving right along. So you want to get traffic. And, you know, there are a lot of traffic agencies out there. There are a lot of methods. There are a lot of strategies in which to get traffic. This is only just one of many, many methods um, and strategies to get traffic. Now, I, I do use Udemy, but you have to, you know, I, I use it with a grain of salt. And what do I mean by that is Udemy, um, Udemy is a network where advertisers and publishers exchange uh they exchange trades uh, specifically for solo ads. Currently, there are no other, according to Udemy, currently there are no other major networks similar to Udemy, Udemy where, any indivi where any individuals are free to join. Anyway, putting it in a nutshell, Udemy is a, a, a place for traffic vendors. So if you're looking to get traffic, you know, they have a host of, they have hundreds and hundreds of traffic vendors that are registered with Udemy. Are they all good? No. So you've got to do your homework, you know, do some research on some of the vendors that they have. And, um, you know, I, I, I'm not going to get into all of that right now, but, you know, if you do some research, you can, you can find some really good uh, diamonds, if you please, diamonds in the rough or whatever. Um, so you can find some good uh, solo ed vendors with Udemy. Um, I would not say the majority of them are good. I would say maybe a handful, you know, 10, 20% maybe. Um, but again, if you do your homework and do your research, you can find some really, really good solo ed vendors through Udemy. And that's what they do. So that's another tool that I use. What's another tool? Well, you've got, you know, you've got all these graphics you want to put together, say a banner on your Facebook page or on your YouTube page or your banner on your website or whatever. Um, well, here's a free tool where you can uh, sign up again for free and develop banners for pretty much any application you can think of. And the, you know, one, one that I use, uh, this is called Canva. C-A-N-V-A, Canva. And Canva is a simplified um, design tool website. And it uses a drag and drop format and provides access to over a million photographs, vectors, graphics, and fonts. And it is used by non-designers as well as professionals. The tools can be used for both web and print media design and graphics. So, 
I use Canva because it does have a lot of tools. It has a lot of graphics that, that are free that you can use in whatever, you know, if you're doing a flyer, doing a web page, doing, you know, a banner for your YouTube page, for your Facebook page, for your website. It doesn't matter. It's very versatile and it comes with all these custom sizes and you can also specify a custom size. If you want a graphic to meet a specific measurement, well, you can also do that as well with Canva. And then lastly, all right, so you've got all this stuff in place. Now, how do you, um, how do you uh, put together videos? Now, there's a lot of different applications out there. Um, and the application that I'm using right now to videotape this, uh, to put on YouTube, I use a product called OBS, Open, Broad, uh, Open Broadcast Software, but is what it stands for. Anyway, I use the OBS Studio. It is, it is, um, uh, it is a free and open source software suite for recording and live streaming. I also use OBS for my Facebook Live videos as well. Uh, it's a great product, and the great part about it is it's free. It doesn't cost anything, and it works really, really well. As you can see, this video, again, is all done using OBS. And um, I will have links to all of these tools below this video, so if you want to check them out, you can. But these are just some of the tools. And just a quick recap uh, of the tools that I use. I use Clip Funnels for building my, my funnels. I use Clip Magic for monitoring and measuring my performance on my funnels and my advertisements and emails. Um, I use Get Response for my autoresponder, but there are others, you know, like I said before, like, um, you know, uh, Get, um, there's, um, uh, MailChimp, there's Aweber, there is Get Response, uh, there's, um, um, I'm trying to think of the other one. I can't remember off the top of my head, but oh, Constant Contact is another one. But I use Get Response because it works, you know, for what I need and my needs. And then for registering your domain, that you can use Namecheap. Uh, it's very, very inexpensive and it's very easy to use, and it's a great way to to uh, be able to monitor and keep all of your domains in one location. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. And then also, I use Udemy on on occasion for uh, traffic generation for buying traffic from traffic vendors. And then I also use Canva for my uh, graphic design, you know, regardless of what I'm doing, whether it's print graphics or social media graphics or whatever. And then lastly, I use OBS uh, for my live streaming and for recording my videos because it does a really good job and it's free. So these are some of the tools that I use, you know, in my business. And again, there'll be links for all of these tools below this video. And um, also there'll be a description again below this video of all these tools that, that I, you know, I just mentioned, kind of give you an overview of what they are. And, uh, and again, with each tool, there'll be a link on how you can get, uh, get, this, get these tools for yourself. So anyway, hopefully you got some value out of this. And if you did, please comment um, because I respond to all my comments. I enjoy reading them. And I really do appreciate it. And uh, if you got any, you know, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel below. And because um, uh, I'll be providing more, uh, you know, more information, more tools, more tips, more strategy going forward on how you can build a business of your own as an independent entrepreneur online. So if you got value out of this, or if you'd like to learn more about how you can build your own business, how you can be an effective entrepreneur, how you can put, you know, learn strategies and tools and tips and insight on how to become the absolute best entrepreneur you possibly can be. Well, then just go to, um, let's go to this link right here. Let's go to this link right here. Now this link will also be below this video in a hyperlink so you can click on that as well but this is not an MLM it is not an income opportunity but it is a training center a training hub uh, created by entrepreneurs for entrepreneurs so if you are a serious entrepreneur and you want to gain all the tools all the strategy all the insight that you, you know that you need to be the absolute best entrepreneur you possibly can be then just go to this link right here i think you'll really really enjoy it so thank you so very very much for watching and uh, you have a tremendous day and i will see you in my next video thanks so much for watching you take care now bye bye